Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you this super creepy clown look. It's really easy and I really like how it turned out. So we're going to start off with a cream paint and this is in the shade Clown White. And I'm going to be just applying this with a disposable um, makeup sponge because I don't want to use any of my beauty blenders or brushes because this stuff's really thick and can ruin them. And I'm just going to apply a very thin layer over my whole face and then I'm going to take this um, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Milk and I'm putting this just underneath my eyes because I have a lot of darkness under there and I want to make sure I have a blank canvas for my clown face. So yeah, I'm just blending that with the exact same sponge and then for some reason this next part got cut out but all I did was take this um, black eyeliner with an eyeliner brush and I made two long triangles extending from my eyebrows and I'm going to now take um, the same eyeliner and put it all over my lid. Um, you can really use any black eyeshadow or any black product or even if you wanted to do a glam look you could do like super intricate you know eyeshadow or you don't have to do any at all but I thought the black looked creepy so then I just set it with some black powder and then I blended it out with that same black eyeshadow just to create, you know, that smoky eye. For underneath the eyes, I'm going to be making a three point upside down crown. Basically, that's the best way I could describe it. And I'm going to fill it in with the exact same gel eyeliner. This one is in the shade black and it's by e.l.f. It's super affordable and you can use it for so many different things. And yeah, I'm also using this Tarte brush and it is for eyeliner as well. I'm going to just sharpen up the edges around all of the points and then I'm going to do the same exact thing to my other eye. It's okay if it's not perfect, just generally the same. Now I'm going to take that same white pencil and I'm going to put that on the middle of the top triangles to create more dimension and make it look a little bit more realistic. For the clown nose, I just took the same black eyeliner and created a general shape. And I'm using black to create depth. So you'll see that I'm adding red right now. This is a soft matte lip cream by NYX and it's in... I don't know what color it is, but it's a red color, and I'm just going to blend that with my finger, and as you can see, it just makes it look a little bit more realistic because it's lighter right on the tip and it's darker around the edges. Now I'm going to be lining my lips like I normally would, and with this black eyeliner as well, you can use any lip liner or a lipstick, and then I'm going to extend that off the bottom lip and then match it to go up to the top lip, and this is just going to create that creepy clown smile look and then I'm going to add that red color right on the inside and I'm going to even add more black because I just wanted the red to be like directly on the inside of my mouth. Now I'm going to take this red eyeshadow from Mor a Morphe palette and I'm just dusting that on the very apples of my cheeks and yeah that's pretty much the whole face makeup look. You can add anything else that you want, I just decided to leave it there. Then for my hair, I just decided to show you guys this because why not? I just teased it a little bit with this comb and then I separated it into two sides and then I added little buns. They're like on the medium side of my head but they're kind of messy, kind of weird and I thought it looked good with this clown look. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!